Yanni and I are about to get in the pond so that we can catch them. Red bellies are a very aggressive species. Let's take a closer look. So we set up this tank, it's 150 gallons. We scaped it to emulate what a river ecosystem might be like. A few things that the piranhas are going to miss though. The first thing is you can't beat the 700 gallons of swimming space in this pond. The new tank is definitely plenty big for them, but they will miss having the freedom to just explore as if it were a river out here. It is now October. Unfortunately here in Chicago, the weather just kind of goes downhill from here. Piranhas are legal in Illinois because the water does get so cold here that if they were released into a natural ecosystem here, they would die off. Me being the bigger animal, I think when we get in there, they're not gonna wanna mess with us. However, picking them up and transporting them into the buckets is where we have to be careful, Yanni, because you remember what happened to Jack, right? Yeah, I do, he took his finger off. Our cousin Jack's in town. Why don't you pick one up? So yeah. we're gonna let him put one in using his hands. No, you're fine, bro. They're, they won't bite you. Either. You see, that's what- Oh, there you go, there you go, there you go. There you go. Oh, oh, go. Ah, ah. Oh. He did not bite oh, me. Oh, he did? Oh my god. Dude, he yeah. grabbed the biggest one. Are you seriously that scared? No, I'm not that scared. It's just I want to see how they react to your feet before they see mine. So the point of what I'm doing right now is to just sit as still as possible to let these piranhas recognize the fact that there is a bigger animal than them in the water and for them to get comfortable with that before we try to catch them. Up until this point, it seemed like the piranhas wanted nothing to do with me. But now, it was time to meet them face to face. Yanni's a fisherman. We got another one. That's the last one. Oh god. Dude, this is this was the big one. Just in time guys, we got all eight of our piranhas. So uh, somehow, some way, two guys with two nuts in a 700 gallon pond caught all eight piranhas. <laughs> I don't think you don't even understand how hard that is. That was very like, difficult. Yeah. Pat on my own back, bro. This water's nice and toasty for the piranhas. Mm. These guys are going from a 65 degree pond into a 75 to 80 degree tank right here. Temperature acclimation was no joke this time. One? I think that's the big one. That's the big one. Wow, wow. Yeah, that's the beast. Dude, look, dude, he's massive. Bro, I didn't even realize it, but that little guy has the sharpest teeth out of the entire pack. He's one of the smallest, but this guy has like razor sharp teeth. And he's not afraid to show them. Yo, I love this tank so much. This is exactly what I wanted. 